Hello friends, welcome to our channel Google Galaxy. We are going to talk about the oxidation and the reduction reaction. In the world of chemistry, we say we define the oxidation reaction as when we say oxidation, when there is a when we say oxidation, when there is a addition of oxygen to a substance you have to just remember as it is there there is an addition of addition of oxygen to a substance we call as that oxidation takes place similarly if there is a removal of hydrogen atom removal of or we can say hydrogen from a substance we also called as oxidation when these two things happen simultaneously or independently we called that oxidation takes place when we say reduction reduction is is an opposite of oxidation we say the, when there is an addition of hydrogen addition of hydrogen we called to a substance we called reduction takes place similarly in reduction there is a removal of oxygen removal of oxygen from a substance from a substance so we are having give you an example here re ox combining these two we get a value that we get a term redox so oxidation and reduction we also called as redox reaction we are having the re ox overall becomes redox so what is the other name of oxidation and the reduction reaction redox reactions i'll give you an example to clarify this concept oxidation and the reduction if i just heat copper oxide in the presence of hydrogen and we heat it this one is symbol of heat delta is a symbol of heating it becomes copper and h2o that is water in this reaction the copper oxide is changed into copper that oxygen is removed from the copper over here on the reactant side we are having oxygen with copper but on the product side we are having a copper alone so we say oxygen is being removed from the copper oxide now by definition by definition we say the removal of oxygen from a substance here substance is copper when there is a removal of oxygen from a substance we called that we call this one as reduction and we can say that copper oxide is being reduced so what is the first result from this reaction that oxygen is removed from the copper oxide when there is a removal of oxygen we we called that that the reduction takes place we can say copper oxide is being reduced to copper so reduction takes place in this reaction h2o is changing into h2o h2 changing into h2o so that is oxygen is added to the hydrogen on the reactant side hydrogen is not with the oxygen but on the product side oxygen is along with the hydrogen so by definition we call there is an addition of 
oxygen to the hydrogen so when there is an addition of oxygen to a substance we call it as oxidation so we say that the hydrogen is being oxidized to H2O or water we, remember one thing we find that the hydrogen is being oxidized to water at the same time copper oxide is is reduced to copper this shows that oxidation and reduction takes place together remember one thing always that the oxidation reduction is always take simultaneously so we say that the it becomes removal of oxygen removal of oxygen so we write over here removal of oxygen similarly there is an addition of oxygen we when this addition of oxygen we called oxidation we say oxidation we write over here reduction we write over here reduction okay remember one thing that the copper oxide is giving oxygen to the hydrogen over here oxygen is along with the copper but on the product side copper is alone it means copper has given oxygen to hydrogen so we called copper as oxidizing agent we are having the overall four terms oxidation reduction we are having the oxidizing agent and reduction agent and reduction agent agent means what that helps to that helps to produce the necessary output so here without copper oxygen will be not oxygen will not be given to the hydrogen with the help of copper we have passed oxygen element to the hydrogen so we say that the here copper oxide is one which give away the oxygen to the hydrogen so copper oxide we called as we called copper oxide as oxidizing agent oxidizing agent so we say copper oxide is acting as acting as two that one is copper is is re reduction and the reduction is also a is also called as oxidizing agent similarly hydrogen is being oxidized that hyd that hydrogen accept the oxygen similarly because of hydrogen copper has reduced so we called hydrogen as reducing agent reducing agent the element which behave as oxidizing agent oxida oxidation the element which do oxidation which does oxidation is also called as reducing agent while the element which which is acting as oxidizing agent is is doing the reduction this is whole about the oxidation and the reduction